In 1926, one acre of land in the UK cost 30 pounds, the equivalent of 2,000 pounds today. Now, one hectare or 2.5 acre in London, if you can find it, can cost up to 93 million pounds. If your grandparents knew it, I'm sure they will have jumped on this opportunity. But if you fast forward today, I believe there is an opportunity with similar potential, and that is purchasing land in the metaverse. Your grandparents couldn't foresee what was possible with the land by that time, but you can. The musician Travis Scott did a concert in 2020 in Fortnite with over $20 million in revenue. Facebook completely rebranded their name to Meta. A record $2.43 million was paid for a plot of land in this central land. Snoop Dogg, Atari, the Hong Kong property tycoon Adrian Cheng invested heavily in sandbox land, and the South China Morning Post has its own plot of digital land. I honestly believe that this is an opportunity that can't be missed, same as purchasing land in the 1900s. And in this video, I'm going to show you the six ways that I discover that you too you can use to create extra stream of passive income with digital land. Stay tuned! If I can change my life, so can you. Subscribe to my channel and i show you how. My name is Fabrizio Cravero. In this channel, I usually look different and I talk about property investment in the UK. But when I saw that extra passive stream of income can be created through digital land in the metaverse, I couldn't resist. I had to make a video on that. I've been researching and studying for several months now, and I spotted six different ways to create passive stream of income by buying digital land in the metaverse. And before we get more into those arguments, if you like videos about property investment and how to generate a passive income, be sure to like and subscribe. I release new videos like this one every week. And also check the free sneak peek to my property investment course in the description below. But now, your time is valuable and let me tell you about the metaverse. If you are not familiar with the metaverse, it is just a virtual reality world where people at the moment go to play games and experience things. But honestly, I believe it will be the evolution of social media today. Probably with glasses like this one, this is just a prototype of augmented reality glass that I got a few years ago. Or maybe it can be with contact lens, let's see. And we will be able to experience what Mark Zuckerberg envisioned will be the way we will work, meet and exercise. We are very much at an early stage now, but if Mark Zuckerberg and many others' vision of the future will become reality, digital land will be more and more valuable. Digital land is sold as NFT, which means non-fungible token. NFTs are powered by smart contract to handle the transferability and verify the ownership. By design, NFTs are scarce but there are many metaverse words at the moment. For example, in the sandbox, there are 166,000 and plus plot of land. In the central land, there are 90,000 plus plot of land. So, one of the cons against investing in metaverse land today is about deciding in which metaverse to buy land. But I guess the big rewards of entering a market at such an early stage is really about understanding which one will be the future YouTube, Facebook or Instagram. You can easily check the top metaverses of the past week, month or all time where you can buy land. Some of the top metaverses are Decentraland, Sandbox, Axie Infinity, Roblox. I leave the OpenSea link down in the description below. So, once you choose the metaverse you are going to invest in, there is actually a multitude of different things you can use the piece of land you end up buying. Metaverse land become valuable asset just like physical land, and people can make money by selling them, leasing them or building on them. Look at what the digital real estate investment firm Republic Realm, that bought the most expensive digital land ever traded, says. The land will be used to build and develop metaverse buildings and premises, 
where people can meet, attend exhibitions, events, and generally live a virtual reality in parallel with real life. So, first you can create a business that operates within the metaverse. By creating a business on that piece of land, you can start charging for whatever product or service you are putting out there. In the metaverse, there are casinos, for example, or you can have your own shop. Big brands like Nike, Adidas, Louis Vuitton, Balenciaga already started to create digital products. Sorry for the interruption, we get back to the video in a moment. You may be planned to invest in the UK, but you live far away from the area where you want to invest in. Or you live overseas like me and you don't know how to do it. I prepared a free training where I show you how you too you can invest in the UK no matter where you live. Join me in this free training, there is a link in the description below and I'll let you enjoy the rest of the video. Then another way to generate income from digital land is by hosting events and parties. For example, Snoop Dogg is hosting an exclusive party inside the sandbox and he has an NFT pass that people have to own to get access. Or I can host a UK property investment networking event in the metaverse, for example, maybe with these glasses. <laughs> or why not let the user play games on your plot of land? And if you are not a techie like me and you don't know how to build a virtual game, you can always lease that plot of land and collect rent. And another way of collecting rent is by building a house or an estate in the metaverse. Same as in real life, you can develop land and build. Look at Exclusible Hill, for example, with their residential area reserved to influential people. Of course, also in the digital world, location is fundamental. Exclusible Hill, for example, is located at the center of the sandbox world, just right next to Snoop Dogg Land. Another way you can make passive income with some digital land, for example the sandbox word, you can stake the sandbox token up to 25% APR, however you cannot rent the land in that case. And of course you're going to buy land with cryptocurrency and if the price rise that can be an extra advantage. But on the other hand, and that leads me to the big warning here, as I said we are at a very early stage now. And as Gary Vee says, 98% of the NFTs will fail. The cryptocurrency market is extremely volatile and we don't know which metaverse will be the dominant one in the future. So as usual, due diligence is key and be really, really careful when investing in digital land. I love and I will always love my boring buy to let houses. But I'm also aware that there's going to be a lot of opportunities in the future. And I honestly, I'm always open to it. Who knows, in the future, in the Property Investment Secrets platform, you may be able to buy digital land as well. But for the time being, you can get access to the free sneak peek of the Property Investment Secret course in the description below. And my plan for this year is to start to reinvest a small percentage of the income generated by my UK properties in the metaverse and start exploring this route as well to create an extra stream of income. I will definitely keep you updated on that, but I really want to know your thoughts about the metaverse and the digital land. So please leave your comment below, just below this video, press the like button if you enjoy the content, subscribe to the channel, and as I always say, invest with knowledge, create financial freedom, and I'll see you in the next meta video.